In today's video, we are going to start a new series called Virtual Pinball 101. And the reason why is a lot of people don't even know what virtual pinball is, what it brings to the table, whether or not they should build one themselves or purchase a commercial unit, etc. So this 101 series will address these questions. Today's video is really just about the basic question, what is a virtual pinball? So let me dive into it right away. Virtual pinball arose about 10, 15 years ago when computing power and resolutions on monitors became good enough to recreate actual mechanical machines in digital format. And so there has been an effort ongoing over the past 15 years where we've gone from 1080p displays to 4K displays right now. And as you can see on the inside of these units, there is a ton, and I mean a ton, of DOF devices. DOF stands for Device Output Frameworks. And these devices that you see in here, all of this, enable the machine to actually look real. We'll go into more details about the DOF devices and in a future video, but this Ultra VP that we manufacture here at Rec Room World is one of those better commercial units that are available that make the experience of owning a virtual pinball machine as good, if not better, than actually owning a mechanical device. The reason why it's better is because in one machine, you end up with over a thousand tables, right? You have everything and then more. Let me show you here under the top 50 category what we have here. This would be a good example of the uh, ACDC table. And you can see the detail of this. It literally, even though it's a two-play screen, it li literally looks real. It's, it's scanned in 4K. It's absolutely beautiful and gorgeous. Now those flashers you see in the back there can be turned off or on, so it's not like you have to have those on, but it, is, uh, it does add to gameplay. So we have things like the Adams Family. I'm gonna try to zoom out a little bit here to show you the play fields. Attack from Mars, Avatar, Back to the Future, The Dark Knight, which that's absolutely gorgeous. And we have things like The Black Knight, Bride of Pinbot, Cactus Jack, yeah, sorry, Cactus Canyon, Champions Pub, Circus Voltaire. Now that is also gorgeous. Let me turn off the flashers for a second on the back just to give you a, a better idea of what the play field looks like here. Sorry about the glare. I know it's, it's being done during the day here. But yeah, there you go. So, and these machines are so realistic that you can even nudge the ball with digital nudging and gyroscopes that are built in. Anytime the ball hits a bumper or the slingshots here on the sides, you're gonna hear those solenoids fire and make it feel real. Uh, when you destroy the, uh, the, the circus clown or whatever this is supposed to be, you are going to hear the shaker motor go off. When there is a crane, like on the previous uh, machine, that's Batman machine, when that crane goes back and forth, you hear the gear motor going off. So virtual pinball has come a long way to make it feel real, right? Now, don't take me wrong, not all virtual pinball machines here are made equal. When you shop around for virtual pinball, it is going to have a ton of differences. We're gonna have another video talking about the competition versus the Ultra VP, but don't take my word for it in terms of this unit being one of the best. You can go on the Facebook page called Ultra VP Fan Page and join and read up on it. It's basically become a community of its own. What's most important is that you now understand that this can be played on a digital screen, on a 4K display, with all three screens, the middle one being the DMD and the backlash screen, as well as a topper monitor, which is optional. These four screens work in conjunction. So anytime I actually switch to another table, let me show you this. Let's go to the Creature of the Black Lagoon right here. There you go. So now you have your table, and I haven't even loaded it yet, right? This is just a preview on the menu. This is gonna be showing the, the actual screen, the play field. Then you have your full color DMD. 
your back glass, and on top, this is a topper. This is an acrylic topper that it's displaying, right? So that's kind of what this is made of. Tons and tons of tables, beautifully rendered. And as you can see here, it looks three-dimensional even though it's a two-dimensional table. And the feel and fun factor is the same as a mechanical table if you purchase the right virtual pinball machine. Now, again, if all they did is connect the computer and three screens, you're not gonna get the feel and the realism. You're just gonna be playing a video game. Hope this helps. If you have questions about virtual pinball, let us know. You can research it uh, online. You're gonna see a ton of forums. It's a hobbyist community and it's ongoing. They constantly add new tables and improve the ones that exist. So it's really, really cool. Um, the differences between machines, the competition, what makes a good machine versus not is going to be in another 101 video. Right now, this was just for you guys to realize that it exists, it's there. One machine, over a thousand tables, playable in your home and they feel real if you buy the right machine. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to join us uh, by subscribing on this YouTube channel. Hit the notification bell if you wanna see and be notified of the next 101 series videos. And don't forget to go to our YouTube channel. There are plenty of gameplay videos and other videos talking about the Ultra VP if that interests you.